Hello, it's Marion Stewart and welcome to my weekly wisdom. Today is week three of my summer series and I'm focusing on positive body image. So for most of us going through the menopause, it's a real downtime for self-esteem and body image. Usually women have gained weight and they go downhill gradually, maybe after they've had babies, but certainly the metabolism slows down at midlife as I was talking about last week and it can go from bad to worse. And we get up in the morning sometimes wishing that we could stay in bed and remembering life as it was and feeling that that part of our life is over. And so many people buy into the fact that menopause is the beginning of the end, but in fact it can be a whole new beginning if you learn how to meet your needs. And it does take a while to get over your symptoms. My program is a five month program and it does take several months to get your nutrients back into an optimum range and to feel really well again. But while you're doing that there are things that you can do to make yourself feel better in the short term. And one of them is positive thinking. Now that may sound a bit woo-woo, but in fact there is so much research to show that positive thinking really does help. It does change things. It's the colour of the lenses through which you see the world. Now when you've got low levels of nutrients, very often the picture looks blacker. And when you get yourself back into nutritional shape, you're back to looking through the rose-tinted lenses. So in the short term, you can actually go back to visioning yourself as how you would like to be in the long term. How were you at your best? And how would you like to be again? And that's something that you can even create a vision board about. And you can give it some thought every single day and aim towards feeling really good again. And I think you need to not lose sight of the fact that you can feel better than you can ever remember. And most women don't really realise that until they come on the boot camp or come and get some help, that they've gone downhill so slowly and they get a really negative attitude about what menopause means and feel that life as they knew it is over. And it's far from that. So you've got a blank canvas again. Once you get symptom free, you've got this wonderful blank canvas and you can decide what you want to put on it. You can decide if you want to carry on doing the same things or new adventures or change your career or new hobbies or whatever it is but you'll have the energy to do it so you have to spend some time every day visualizing yourself exactly as you'd like to be and that helps you to become that as you go through the process of getting yourself back into really good shape again so it becomes a practice just like cleaning your teeth so you need to find time every day or you just think about yourself and picture it in your mind like a film. Watch yourself being the you you'd love to be. And hopefully over time that will rub off and you'll start feeling really good again.